little Talia. Talia. Sorry. That's okay. Nice to meet you. That's okay. Lovely to meet love you. That. Oh, thank you. It matches your lipstick. Thank you. Do you want to put your stuff down? Yes, that would be. You can put it here if you want. Perfect. Thank you. What song are you gonna perform? You can have a seat here. Um, Vampire Night. Okay, nice. Is that gonna be the first your first single? Um, well, um, it's just one of my favorites, I guess. It's one I'm of your favorites. Happy through my album, but I think eventually when I get to that stage, then possibly. Then possibly. Okay, so Vampire's Night. Vampire Night. Yeah. Vampire Night. What is that about? <laughs> Vampire night? A vampire, vampire night? night. <laughs> what does that mean though? Like a scary night? Or... Yeah, exactly. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I like that a lot. All will be revealed. All will be revealed when we hear this song. Exactly. Which we're going to do in not too long. In not too long. Vampire, vampire, this is vampire night. Let them stay inside. Vampire, vampire, this is vampire night. Let them stay inside. Right. Um, because this is going to be your debut album, right? Yep, that's okay. It. And you're working with your dad on it. Yes, I am. What is that process like? Is I it know. ever awkward or like intrusive? Well, I think because it is him, it's completely relaxed. Like if Good. it was anyone else, I think I would be like, oh my goodness, this is quite, you know. Yeah. I think because it's him, it's a bit more relaxed. That's and, so nice. You know. And that's sort of how you got your start, right? Mm -hmm, exactly. You did a song for a film that your dad was directing. Um, yes. And um, that was just kind of chance again. He was he had like a demo singer and she couldn't come in because something happened. So he was like, quick tally. I, at the time he didn't realize I could sing. He was just kind of like, right, quick tally. Really? We, I mean, I blew their heads out in the house. So, you know, quick <laughs> come in, just, you know, a wee, a wee, you know, do, go for it. So anyway, we did it improperly. And ever since then, you know, just kind of, we just kind of, I got more, you know, I worked with like radio stations in Scotland and, and Capital FM and I just kind of, you know, did, Road shows and things like that. Yeah. Now you have a lot of other stuff going on right mm. now. Um, you blog for Huffington Post I Teen. Love that, Post that is so cool. I know it's really fun. Again, that just kind of you know came about. I think they just kind of phoned us and they were like, "Look, um, would you like to do this?" Because they, I think, they just kind of knew that I'd been a big fan. Okay, call me a nerd, but you know I love writing. <laughs> And um, I guess that's not nerdy. Okay, well, I like writing. Yeah. And um, I went to London Fashion Week, and I just started writing things about that, and you know, just fashion things. You know, my sister styles me, so I just started writing things about that. And fashion is about being fun and you know, creative. So we just kind of went for it, I guess. It works for you. It absolutely, absolutely works for you. You're making a name for yourself, not only for your music, your blog, and your style. Thank you. So only good things. I love these happy face sequin Thank pants. Thank you. And your name necklace. Thank Thank you. It, that's a necklace, right? That's a necklace. Very cool. I like it a lot. Just in case I forget money? Yeah, <laughs> in case anyone else forgets your name. No one needs to yeah, ask Yeah, exactly. Anymore. Changing topics just a little bit. Mm -hmm. You definitely are known for being semi-discovered by Elton John. Yep. You gave your mixtape to his partner. Partner, David Furnish. At breakfast one day in Hawaii. Crazy uh -huh. story. I love this story. Uh -huh. And he called you up and was like, hey, I love your mm -hmm. songs. Let's have you open for me. So yep. that was huge for you. Incredible. Have you kept in touch with him lately? Yes, I have. Um, I think he's just, everything he's just kind of told me is like there's no rush and you've just got to, you know, keep practicing and, um, you know, be 100% dedicated. And I know fun well it's not going to happen overnight, but I've just got to, you know, stick to it. And eventually, one day, then, you know, be selling at Staples Center. Yeah. That's the dream. Yeah. What do you think you would ever collaborate with him on a song? Well, Has that, that been discussed? I think that would be an honor, but I think eventually I, when I get to that stage, you know, Incredible! <laughs> Incredible! I can't wait for that. Thank you. Okay guys, please welcome Talia Storm back to Clever. She's going to perform her song Vampire Night right now, so go check it out. Eastside shut down so 